Iron has doubled its GPU fleet to 8,500 units and has also secured 102 million in financing uh, to pay back prior units that it has purchased. So now Iron has uh, 8,500 uh, NVIDIA GPUs after um, it has purchased 4,200 recently. And some of these are Blackwell B200s and B300s. And um, Iron it has, like I said, raised some money to pay back uh, you know, one of the uh, the next installment for a prior deployment of GPUs. And they're looking for financing for this next one because these are quite expensive. This 4200 Blackwell purchase was cost them $193 million. But interestingly, you know, um, Iron, unlike other Bitcoin miners like HUD-8, you know, um, Core Scientific, all of these other ones, they're not doing the PowerShell model, right? They're not like just building massive facilities and trying to find a tenant to park GPUs there. They are actually going to rent out the compute themselves and operate it in their own facilities. You know, are there going to be any pure poly miners left by the end of the year? Yeah, it is a big question. And like with CleanSpark now, they might look at it now that Zach's out. They yeah. mentioned that um, in, you know, some public statements. So we'll see. It, it's like maybe that's the thing that holds us back uh, to uh, one Zeta hash, it's the it's the wind in our face, which is the profitability of AI HPC deals. 